situated on the top of Mitcham, positioned in some of the most beautiful parkland that the eastern suburbs has to offer. As we stand here at Unit 4 of 26, Burnett Street, Mitcham, the opportunity that it affords you at this stage is here today. Ladies and gentlemen, if you come to buy a home for yourself or possibly to upgrade or possibly looking for a lower maintenance lifestyle, this beautiful property has been fully renovated by our vendors, offers for you a truly unique proposition here in the beautiful suburb of Mitcham. Well, a very good morning to you, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to today's auction. My name is Grant Lynch. On behalf of McGrath Estate Agents and our vendors, we very warmly welcome you to today's proceedings of this uh, beautiful sale. I'm very excited to uh, be offer for you here. Here we have Sarah McGuire as well to assist you, plus a couple of the guys as well at the back there will be here to help and assist you with your purchase here today. If during the course of the auction, if you have any questions, please let us know. We're more than happy to help you with your buying. We are selling here today by public auction at a price that you get to determine for us. You do that by raising your hand and calling out a bid and that's how you purchase real estate in Melbourne. The copy of title is described as volume number 10320, folio number 304, better known to you, I and the neighbours, as unit 4 of 26, Burnett Street, here in Mitcham. If you are the purchaser here today, a 10% deposit we will need, check's the easiest way to do it, and the balance in a further 45 or 60 days, that'll certainly get Christmas out of the way for you. I'll just run through the rules. The auction will be conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions that were made available for inspection before the start of the auction. The auction rules for an auctioneer from accepting bids or offers for a property after the property has been knocked down to the successful bidder. The vendors have a reserve price. I will indicate bidders on request. The law prohibits false bids and prohibits major disruptions by bidders and prohibits bidders attempting to prevent others from bidding and provide fines for this conduct. The words I'll use to indicate I'm making a bid on behalf of the vendor are vendor bid and by law. Only I as the auctioneer can make a bid on behalf of the vendor. So what's that all mean? Well, very simple. If you're here to buy today, ladies and gentlemen, call it out, let us know, give it a wave, and uh, you will have just bought yourself this beautiful home. And we've had the rules, section 32's contracts and everything on display for the last half an hour. Does anyone at all have any questions? Anything you'd like me to clarify for you before we get started? spot we're in so well, when it comes to buying property you don't buy because of the name the name of the game here is the location and what a terrific location where you're in situated only moments away from Yarran Darren where all the koalas and wallabies live for this part of the suburbs it's just around the corner that we have the uh, privilege of living around truly one of the nicest walking running tracks that we have in the area Shopping, well, just obviously around the corner from Mitcham Shops, there being Mitcham Station as well, Eastland just around the other way. Now that is the convenience that this home offers for you. But the, truly, I think the thing that's really grabbed everyone's attention is the quality of the floor plan and the renovation that our vendors have put in to this beautiful home. 20 years young, single story, three bedrooms, two bathrooms, double garage, been fully updated and renovated only in the last few years. That with a high quality kitchen, laundry, cabinetry, bathrooms have also been done. New carpet, paint throughout, new flooring, three split systems, which look, I'll emphasize that on a day like this because having lots of air conditioning is obviously very important for ducted heating as well throughout winter. Plenty of space in the double garage plus a storage shed out the back. But as we stand here at the rear of the block, this is your space as well. This is plenty of space for visitors to park when they come through or as a turning circle if you're wanting to drive out to head off to work in the morning. So ladies and gentlemen, over the last of four weeks of our auction campaign, we have been quoting a fair and reasonable price of in excess of $700,000. So enough from me, I'll open it up to you. Who wants to start us off? The auction of 426 Burnett Street here in Mitchell. Here looking at everyone, everyone else is looking around, everyone else here will be the first person to put their hand up. Else are here to buy, raise your hand, call out a bid. That's seven hundred and ten thousand. That's seven hundred and ten thousand dollars. That's seven hundred and ten thousand dollars. Call it three times, you'll miss your opportunity. That's seven hundred and ten. First call at seven hundred and ten thousand. That's seven hundred and fifty-five thousand sixty. Made it fives, makes it easy. 760 now, thank you very much. That's 760 now, am I right? Back to you now, sir. 760, 
five if you like, or maybe you round me up to still two purchases. I'm sure you're not going to be living together, but uh, at this point it's here, possibly with yourself, <laughs> sir. 765, shall I say? Thank you very much. Welcome to back. At 765, we've got back to you, sir. You're buying here today at 765,000. Next bid would bring you to 770. It's getting warm at this point now, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Really yeah. Hot. Really hot. 765, it's with you, sir. It's now against yourself at 770,000. Grab the keys, secure the home for yourself. 76570, yeah. thank you, welcome back on top. Family for the last 10 years, and now it will be yours too. Or possibly yours, maybe someone here. We're on the market, we're selling, we're playing for keep. Good choice. That's 784, worth it any day of the week. Three bed, two bath, fully renovated, move straight in, nothing to do. $783,000. Got a five? <laughs> We could chip away with ones or go a bit bigger. 785. Oh, no. <laughs> 790. Oh, careful with this one. Uh, 786. 786, good choice. $786,000 now. At 786,000, it's here. Seven or maybe do the same, a bit larger. Let's go to 790, perhaps, sir. 795, good choice. That's 795,000. That's the way you do it. That's the way to secure a home. 797. 797. Good choice. Even better. At seven hundred and ninety-seven thousand dollars. At seven ninety-seven. Bring me to seven, maybe, sir. Round me up. Seven with a bunch of zeros after it. Seven. Eight. Oh, eight. <laughs> even better. Even better. <laughs> I got stuck on the seven. I think. Seven hundred and ninety-seven thousand. Round me up would be eight hundred for sure. Or maybe seven ninety-eight. Seven ninety-nine. 798, thank you sir, back on top. $798,000 is the call. 798, got. 802, it is. 802,000 now. Back to you now, sir. We're here at 802,003, shall I say? Done, 803. 803 to four. 804 now, we've got. 804,000 to five, if you will. Five it is, thank you. 805 now, 805, raise me to 6 or bounce it up to 10 maybe, 805 to 6, 10, ten good choice, 810 we've got, 810,000 now, 810, another one or 15, 15 good choice <laughs> sir, 815 it's with you, 815 it nearly worked, we'll do it again to 20, 17, 817, 817, 817,000. 18 or 20? That we will. That we will. The more you think, the more it'll make sense. New kitchen, laundry, bathrooms, carpet, <laughs> flooring. Think of the money you're going to save. Move in, nothing to do. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I think, are you trying to hit me or, or cool me down? You those things. Bids here at eight hundred and seventeen thousand dollars to yourself, sir. Bring me to eight eighteen, eight twenty. Anything further buys the property. We're playing for keeps. So I've just got to work out which one of you lovely people are moving in. Eight hundred and seventeen thousand. Ten fifteen minute walk up to Mitcham Station. The shops. It's even a terrific new bar that's opened up. Go visit it this afternoon. Forages drop. The Mitchum's going off. We got great burgers, restaurants, shops, transport. For another $1,000 secures all of that for you, sir. $820,000 now, or anything further, another one. A half even. A half, good choice, 821 and a half. I will, I will, I'm sorry, but I promise I'll do it for you in 10 years time as well. 821, 500. Yeah, half. Half 22. I will. 822. I think I need a new shirt, is what I'll need. 822. Anything further, sir? Another half. 830. 830. 830. Done. 830,000. 830,000 we have here. 31. Back on top. 831. 
No, but I, there's one inside. Whoever buys the property gets the drink, I promise. <laughs> 32. Back on top, 832. 832,000 now. 33 it is. 834 now. 834,000. Five done, sir. $835,000 now we've got. 36 it is. 836,000. 836,000. 30, 38. 37. I'll take a half again. 836,500. 836,500 here. 37 it is. $837,000 now. Oh, wait till you see when it, this shirt. Oh, seriously, it's gone translucent. Oh, I tell you, it'd be terrible. Eight hundred and thirty-seven thousand dollars. Eight 